So it, it's weird when I'm at a loss for words because I'm supposed to be the words person, but I. I truly don't believe that any of us have fully processed what the hell we just witnessed because we literally witnessed NFL history, 33 points, the greatest comeback in the history of the national football league. And it's just, it's just insane. Just absolute complete insanity that the Vikings scored 36 points in 23 minutes, 22 seconds to round out the second half to force overtime. And then they win it at the end. It's it, it just one of those standard Vikings games where you just run the complete emotional roller coaster. Like this, is, this was the Bills game on steroids. It, it really was. And just from games like this, I love looking at the win probability graphs where you know the Colts they scored early, they scored often, they got up to ninety nine point six percent. Yeah, that's probably after the Vikings punted early in the second half. The Vikings still aren't a third quarter team, by the way, and. Just taking that 0.4% and just spinning it all the way up to a hundo, it, it's just, it still blows my mind, man. It, it does. And it, it really is the, they had us in the first half, not going to lie. And also the call an ambulance, but not for me. We've used that meme template like 95 times this season. But how do you go from 33 points down, put together a drive, get a touchdown, get a score, you know, they get another field goal and then just keep roaring back. I, 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 I don't get it, man. And, just to be a fly on that wall in the locker room at halftime when everyone's sort of down in the dumps, you know, coaches are just kind of like, hey, 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 let's put something together the second half. Let's get one drive. Let's get one stop. It's all that. And, you know, Kirk Cousins is relaying that Patrick Peterson at halftime said that all they need is five touchdowns. And you know, to a degree, I mean, it probably came off as sarcastic, but no one P squared, he's a very serious dude. And he, he probably believed that. And you know, the defense got stops. Respect. They held the Colts to three points uh, in the second half after the Colts had 29 offensive points in the first half. Remember, they, uh, they also scored a touchdown. Wait, no. They had 26 offensive points in the first half. Uh, they had, you know, they scored off of uh, that blocked field goal, uh, or blocked punt, rather. And, I mean, it was a fantastic performance by the defense. Should have been amplified even more with Sean Don Sullivan getting two fumble sixes, but... You know, the refs completely took that away. I mean, the Vikings not only beat the Colts, but they beat the refs and also they beat themselves. <laughs> well, they beat themselves in the first half for sure. But it's just like, how, how, how do we get moments like this? I mean, Kirk Cousins in his new jacket looking like the Riddler and also like that Matthew Lesko guy who told you how to get money from the government in his books. It's just insane. It's just insane. They, they clinched. They got their T-shirts. They got their hats. And, and this this game has to give them well first off the, the way that they've operated this season in close games has to give them confidence the comeback against the bills has to give them confidence uh, and of course this game you could say sure how did you get down by 33 points uh to one of the worst teams in the league that was four eight and one coming in and averaging 12 points a game uh, on the road uh with with a fake uh, interim head coach don't care don't care. They're still professionals on that side of the ball, too. And they they whooped the Vikings' ass in the first half, man. But the Vikings came roaring back. They did not quit. They put together a drive, then another drive, then another drive. And that's, I mean, I mean, tough situation. Just create character. And the Vikings have all the character. They have all the heart. They got that dog in them. Uh, and any team with any sort of lead on the Vikings, like they, they can't just feel comfortable with it because the Vikings don't quit. They'll, they're like Goonies. They don't quit, and they never say die. But uh, that's it. I'm just processing this stupid, insane game. Let us know your thoughts and our thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Once we'll support the work, put a little something in the Venmo. But until next time, Skull Production Value.